Why doesn't Lock say you tell them Pomu anymore? I've never done that. Not a single time. Tell them Pomu. Let's play some toss three coin deck. It's a little bit different from a gamble deck because it specifically uses cards that tosses three coins, not one. Proceeds to change deck. These are just my warm up decks. The Walmart gamble deck. No, this is triple coin toss. It's amazing. Let's play Ally of Justice Quarantine. And then two cards face down. Okay. Just funny how I edit one and then you switch to a different one. I'll play it again next time I stream using my warm up decks. Okay, and immediately activate Soul of the Supreme King to special summon the Ark. All right, this is Jax that just failed top 10 creations. Top 10 cards with triple in their name or three in their extra that failed. Nah, yeah. That's a neat idea for a list though. I was looking for some terrible ideas. Absolute garbage. Ooh, they actually activated a spell? Now I get negates, you absolute buffoon. A royal Zark. I love my royal Zark. He's my best friend. Okay, we'll get this card in attack position. We'll get this card in attack position. We'll get this card in attack position. And we'll get this card in attack position. Is this the deck for your tournament? No, I'm not playing in the tournament. Hi, Dulox, how are you? Uh, I'm managing. That looks painful to resolve. Yeah, it's great. Dude, I'm surprised there's so many people who are excited for the tournament. When they first came to me with the idea, I just thought, wow, that's neat, I guess. <laughs> Let's activate this so I can become immune to monster effects for the rest of the turn and gain a whole bunch of attack points. Logs, but my idea, top 10 monsters of effects when flip summon but aren't flip monsters is a great idea. <gasps> that is a good idea. I still gotta look through the list. I got a whole bunch of lists. I, I asked for like specifically ideas for like terrible top 10 ideas. And I just got a whole bunch of really generic ones instead. There were a couple of really good, absolutely incredibly specific bad top 10 ideas, which I love and I'm gonna probably do some of them. But there was also just a lot of just normal top 10 ideas. Crystal clear, kind of too good. Also same with Waking the Dragon. Crystal clear is really good. A low entry requirement tournament on our most popular platform being popular doesn't surprise me. I'm surprised there's so many people who are like into it. Wait, what did they do? Oh, they're trying to use changeover? That's fine. I can just negate it when they actually use the effect. I saw one of your clips the other day, and now for every minor inconvenience, I just let out you stupid- <laughs> That's funny. The battle phase? Why aren't they using changeover? I wanted to negate it. Main phase, end phase, they're just gonna quit there. Are they gonna try to bounce my card or something? Do they have two forms of removal? Um, oh, they can't go into changeover because Shio is light. <laughs> You absolute buffoon. We'll normal summon this card. And then we'll convert some of these cards. Dragon Maid downtime. Uh, return to the hand. And if you do add a Dragon Maid card, return it to the hand. And if you do return a spell trap, your opponent controls. That's fine. Go ahead. You can have it. I'd rather save my negate for... They have two downtimes? Are you kidding me? Who the hell runs a single downtime? Return it to your hand. <laughs> I mean, I guess I'll negate the other one. Since he doesn't have any other spell traps. Downtime is terrible. I know. That's so funny. Oh yeah, so like the tournament thing, I thought it would be a fun little side project. I just have to put up like what, two to four thousand dollars and then have a couple of weekends dedicated to hosting a tournament. I was like, I'm gonna do, I was planning on eventually hosting tournaments anyway, just for, just to try it out. This will be the greatest opportunity to just try them out, you know? We'll get rid of these ones. Oh, why'd I put them in the extra monster zone? That one, that one, and that one. Okay rather put more negates and let's go into the battle phase and start blasting attack that one activate blackluster soldier soldier of chaos banish one card on the field okay and then we attack with the other ones because they can't go into shio because i locked them out of it with my one ridiculously specific floodgate okay and then end phase because there's so many searchable negates and maids I want to join, but my PC is in repair. Well, there will be more of them. Yeah, but I was more surprised like how many of my um, VTuber friends were interested. Because I didn't think they would care about the tournament at all. And I'm also surprised so many of them just were not trying to pull like connections to get in. It's like, you think we don't want streamers in the tournament or something? 
like MBT was like, yeah, we'll let you know any of them in if they just message me, but no one did. <laughs> so I had to reach out to a lot of them, and some of them just got in the old-fashioned way, like everyone else. Um, let them go to their hand. Oh, I guess I should have did it so I get a little bit more attack power, because I think they can beat over my cards. Oh, they can't. They can only beat over my floodgate. Hello, Mr. Logs in chat. Hello there. I didn't expect the slots to fill in the first five minutes, though. Yeah, neither did I. MBT said on stream of the day he'd make sure Leah got in for sure. The thing is, Leah just got in normally. I also told Leah I'd get her in. <gasps> like, apparently Ame tried to get in too, but she wasn't able to. And I just randomly suggested to her on her stream. I was like, hey, you interested in the tournament? She's like, yeah, I was, but I wasn't able to get in. I was like, oh, I can just get you in. <laughs> Yeah, I sent her a link when the post went live. Yeah, but the thing is, if you sent her a link when the post went live, that doesn't matter because she still has to click on it. Because the links had a limited amount of invites to them. So all that means is she happened to click on the link fast enough within the first couple of minutes. Yeah, activate clear wing synchro dragon in response. And then they're gonna activate their quick effect to get destroyed my card. Oh, I knew we were chatting before it went live. Yeah, I mean, she was, like, at a computer ready to go. Because you had to have, uh, signed up immediately. I mean, it was completely unnecessary. I could have got her in either way. But I'm just, like, surprised so many people were interested in the first place. Because I just didn't think there would be interest from content creators to play in it. Hmm. I can go into BLS because he can't be targeted by anything. I can also normal summon Blowback Dragon to just destroy it with my Photon Blast. So, normal summon. I love how this just acts as tribute fodder, too. But I can understand why she'd want to get in normally and not want to talk to me to get in. <gasps> 500 damage? Ooh, nice. So, like, you know, I don't care that they got in normally. I'm just, like, surprised that they wanted to get in at all. Coin toss. Let's go to the Fist of Fate deck now. 